I don't know how to feel about this altar video, especially after that last one from yesterday. Let's see if this one's any better. You look beautiful. You look beautiful. And I'm glad that you're here. You look beautiful. You are beautiful. You, you look, you are beautiful. And I'm glad that you're here. I'm, I'm glad that we're here. Beautiful, and I'm glad that you're here. And I, I feel like he's doing too much. We really made a connection. He's doing way too much Beautiful. right now. I'm glad that you're here, and I feel like we really made a connection. This nigga simp level is like in the thousands you look right now. Beautiful, and I'm glad that you're here. And I, I feel like. If you're on a date and you see this man just looking at you like this, saying this on the first date, you're going to think he's crazy, right? He looks insane. He looks insane. Bro, you're doing too much. You real extra right now. This is going to go horribly for you. I already know why this is the title. Wait, is this nigga not even on the date yet? After the phone. Oh, no, he's that first. type of weird. I promise. When I speak to women online, I'm not lying to hurt them. I'm lying because I want to be the person I pretend to be. The confident guy who meets someone and charms them. But I can barely leave my apartment. It's like I'm invisible in the real world. Like, I could collapse in the middle of the street and everyone would just walk over me. Every time, I hope I'll change. That it'll be different. If I could just get the nerve. This is gonna be a sad oh, ass fucking horror short. Shifts next week and gave him to Darlene. <sighs> Saving for a vacation. You can have my Thursday shift if you need it. It's okay. <laughs> what am I even complaining for? Poor Darlene. She took this job because her husband was complaining that they didn't make enough money. Then she found out on Facebook that he's still married to his first wife. Wow. I mean, just when you think you know someone, how could you look someone in the eyes and be so cruel? You don't have any secret girlfriends I need to know about, do you? Uh, no, I, I've, I've just been really busy and, and I haven't had, had much time to focus. I'm so. joking, Aiden. <sighs> but let me help you. I know you're one of the good ones. You give us single gals hope. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes! <laughs> she flirting with this man. That's true. See the way she looking at him? That man looks so sad. I'm sorry. I was going to say something about his tub. That Hello? shit was dirty. Sorry, I locked myself out of my apartment. Hi, I was just wondering if you have the manager's number. Uh, yeah. Yeah, until just a minute. This man walked to the door looking crazy. His apartment looks crazy. This doesn't bother you, lady? Hey, this is Aiden in 1203. Um, Chelsea in 1204. Chelsea in 1204 is locked out of her apartment. Could you? All right, I'll send someone right over. Uh, okay. Okay, thanks. Hello, I'll 
be right up. <sighs> Great, thank you. Sorry, I just moved in and I'm already the annoying neighbor. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry about the mess. Did you just move in too? Uh, yeah. Does it look like it did? Well, four years ago. <laughs> cool phone. It's vintage. Well, I don't have a cell phone, so. Good for you. I'm off the grid too. I mean, no Facebook, no Instagram. It's a lot of pressure being someone I'm not. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Oh, I was obsessed with puzzles when I was a kid. I would do one of those 300 piece ones for hours and then the second I was done, I'd just destroy it and start all over. Is there a laundry room in this building? No. Shit. He got something going but on in his head. there is one uh, right down the street past the... That's my cue. <laughs> oh, sorry, what was your name? Aiden. Cool, Aiden. Thanks for the assist. I'll see you around. Oh, he like her. He like her. Now, where the fuck is this from to go? Did he just ask her on a puzzle date? Did he really pretend he had shit to wash to go talk to her? Come on, bro. Just walk in. You look weird. You're, just walk in. Look normal. Bro, you can't do this. This is bad. No, you're a creep. Ah, oh, this is weird. He put the dress on a nigga doll? What? Oh, hey. Look what I saved for you. Oh. <laughs> Isn't it cool? Wow. Thanks. So what do you got there? Oh, I found this in one of the bins today. Another puzzle. Yep. Hey, have you ever been on one of those, like, dating websites? No. Why? Well, I got this group on for one of those photography sessions, and uh, last weekend I had photos made. I've always wanted professional photos of myself, so thought, why not? Oh, wow. Those are nice. Anyway, the photographer thought maybe I should put him on a dating profile. It's probably a silly idea. I mean, I'd rather meet someone in person anyway. She's throwing so many hints, bro. So... How long after meeting someone that you like would you want them to ask you out? I don't know. 
definitely sooner than later. How would you want someone to ask you out? Did you meet someone? <laughs> no, I, I'm, I'm just wondering whether that's all. Well, there's no right way or right time to ask someone out. You just know that you have that connection. It's kind of like when you're, your mouth wants to form the words that a kiss would explain better. If you wait for the perfect moment, you'll never do anything, so just go for it. I can't tell oh. anymore. Hey, Chelsea. Do you like food? <laughs> Bro, just say that. Just say, hey, you like food? I like food too. Let's go get Give some. Give me a call. It's as easy as that, bro. Okay. Yes. I mean, it'd be easier cause to just knock on her door because you're right there, but like, what? <laughs> Is he gonna just sit in front of the phone until he sees her get the note? Yo, he's freaking out. Beautiful, and I'm glad that you're here. And I. You look beautiful, and I'm glad that I'm glad that you're here. And I feel like we we really connected. I what? Feel, I feel like we really connected tonight. You you look beautiful, and, I, and I'm glad that that we're here. And I feel like that we. Wait, but you can't dodge this one though, because she lives across from you. Here, and I feel like we really connected. Is he gonna go? It's gonna be gone. It's gonna be gone. Hello, ow! That's he's fucked. <laughs> he's fucked. Like this bro, just say you woke up, bro. What are you lying for? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I, um, I just, but I found a new puzzle at work yesterday. It's, uh, well, it's, it's, it's actually a really old one. Uh, oh, cool. Well, I just thought that if you weren't busy, maybe you could come over and, uh, we could put it together. Oh, okay. Uh, hey. Are, are you free tonight? Uh, I know it's Friday, but... Yeah, I'll be home at 6. Great. That's perfect. I'll just... I'll see you then. This nigga done got him a puzzle date. <laughs> that is some nerdy white boy shit. A puzzle date. I fucks with it. Okay, but get it together. You really gotta clean your shit up for real. Good morning. Hey, Elaine. It's me. I I don't think I'm gonna be able to come into work today. Oh no, is everything okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I mean, I I will be. It's just a bad. 
cold or something. Could you <clears throat> cover for me? Of course, no problem at all. You get some rest and feel better, okay? Okay, uh, thanks, Elaine. She's dope for that. <laughs> Damn, he cleaned up nice. He got the pizza red three boxes. This was so good, I was starving. I didn't know what you liked, so. Oh, it was perfect. Can't go wrong with pizza. Unless you eat it with a knife and fork. <laughs> Yo, whoever does that is that psycho. Too. I'm I was so wondering. <laughs> you go first. I was just gonna ask about the puzzles you found. Oh, uh, right. <laughs> you know, it's just amazing what. Uh, oh shit! She's away. gonna find the her her fucking clothes. <laughs> what were you gonna ask? Oh, uh, I was just wondering how you like the building. Oh, it's convenient. I see you finally unpacked. Looks good. Thanks. It's definitely less of a transient vibe. Ugh, story of my life. I don't even bother unpacking anymore. So, do you plan on keeping this apartment for a while? I don't know. Maybe. I don't like feeling too settled, I guess. What happens if you meet someone? I'm not trying to meet anyone. Yeah, but what if you have a connection? I stay away from all that. What if you can't? Why are guys so concerned about talking about love and connection when at the end of the day, a man's basic instinct is to spread his seed to as many women as possible? Women are assholes. I'm sorry. Well, you know I where she mean. stands. Look, I'm sure you're great. It's just, I've been hurt a lot and I've realized it's better if I just keep to myself. We can see that. I'm invisible. But you're not invisible, Chelsea. I see you. <laughs> he doesn't. You know, I, I get so nervous when I talk to women, but I've been practicing and I just knew if I could get used to saying the right words with a real person, I'm and the not right sure person, no, I'm... please just let me say this. You look beautiful. And I'm glad that you're here. And I feel like we really have a connection. What the fuck? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I don't know. I don't know why I did that. I, I didn't mean to. I just. I. I, I need Ooh. <laughs> Gotta go, buddy. You fucked it. What is he trying to do? You know what? I think I'm just gonna leave. No, no, please, please don't go. Yo, dude! What are you doing? You can't just be grabbing folk! Wait, whoa, wait, huh? What? Whoa! Wow! Wow, wait. I, I never do. Huh? I wouldn't have agreed to come over if I'd known. Why the fuck did she kill him? in the shower are you his mother no um 
No, I, I work with him. Wow. I'm sick today, so I disrespectful. I, I, I brought him some chicken noodle soup. Oh, she's so nice. Oh, disrespectful. Did you want to come in? Uh, yeah, I, I guess he's feeling better. Um, yeah, just come in. Sure, it's not interrupting anything. Um, actually, I'm. I'm not gonna bother you guys. Are you sure? Yeah, it was really nice meeting you. Ain't no way. Ain't no way she better get away with this. Bro, she really did this nigga in cold. He's alive! Oh, he's a trooper! Homegirl gonna come back and kill her ass. Right? Right? Please. She finna suffocate this nigga? Oh my god! He seemed genuine. Different than the others, but really, most of them started out like Aiden. Well, intended. Oh, this doesn't have a happy like ending. She's sick. Hurting you, even though they always do. I didn't have a choice. I have to protect myself. I started to feel something that can't happen. Oh my God! Everybody else, the ones who devote their lives to finding a soulmate, to protecting their relationships. They're lying to themselves. They're trying to hide the truth. <clears throat> Sooner or later, someone always cheats, lies, runs, ignores, hurts. They don't want to face it. But in the end, we die alone. Holy fucking shit alter <laughs> oh boy alter 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 i don't know what y'all was doing with that last one because that last one was not it but this one right here that was that shit i loved this this was so good. I was really hoping Homegirl was going to come back, kill her, because he was still alive, and you know, they live happily ever after. But no, we die alone. I should have known from the fucking title. I thought, oh, wow. Wow. I thought he was just going to end up killing the person like he, he loved or some shit, which he almost did, but it reversed on me. It, M. Night Shyamalan me for a second. Oh, man, Alter. Y'all did great. I hope y'all enjoyed the reaction. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all next video. I love y'all. Peace. They wanna fall away. Back when I was down bad, I was stuck in the mud. That nigga didn't clean up Louis V on the so-so.